In this video, we'll sync Joplin to access files on other devices. So let's get into it. I'll use OneDrive, but uh, using Dropbox is pretty similar. Ensure you have Joplin opened. You can either click this synchronize button or go to tools and then options. Here, go to this synchronization tab. Don't worry if the options here are different. Click this open sync wizard button and select OneDrive from the list. You can choose Dropbox here. Click this link or open it in the browser. We need to sign in with our Microsoft account. Insert your email and password. Once signed in, you'll see this message on the top. To further ensure, go to Joplin and see this message. Let's go back. We still have a few things to set up. Ensure OneDrive is selected from this list. Select it if not. You can manually sync files by clicking the button on the edit interface and setting the time interval here. I'll set it to every 5 minutes. You can still click the button to sync at any time. Then here are some advanced options. I won't touch them, but those may be helpful in your situation. Let's hit apply and go back. Now clicking here will start the sync process. Oh, it will auto start on time. The last sync time is displayed here. Let's install Joplin on another computer and see if it works. This time, we'll click this sync button and it will open the same wizard. Select OneDrive and follow the same process. I'll open this link and log in with my Microsoft account. You'll see the same message in your browser and the Joplin app. Click the back button. You'll see Joplin populating notes from the cloud. Now we can edit something here and click the sync button or wait for it to auto sync and find changes on other devices. Syncing on mobile devices is also similar. Here is an iPhone and an Android phone. Install Joplin from the store and open it. Click this menu button and then configuration. From the target drop down, choose OneNote. Tap this save button. Then go back and touch the menu button again. And tap this sync button. This will ask you to sign in to the same Microsoft account. Follow the steps. Once the account is signed in, you'll see the downloaded notes. Onwards, touch this sync button after making changes and when the files are synced, you'll see the changes everywhere. Let's see an example. I'll make the changes on my iPhone and tap this sync button. Then I'll tap the same button on my Android phone and on my Windows PC. After the sync is done, we'll see the changes in both devices. So this is it for this video. Thanks for watching. Please let me know if you need any help. I'll catch you later. Take care.